Oh, and she's running, you guys. Guess what? Guess what? There she's running to. Honey, I was out hunting, and there's a big bear. I just barely got out of there before it got me. Hello, all you fabulous and wonderful people. Welcome back to the channel, and welcome back for some more of the Ultimate Decades Challenge. So I'm just having them going off to uh, pick some flowers. So last time we did have our baby, but sadly the baby did not make it. And now we have an empty cradle. Also, I will point out, I did turn off the aging here. Basically I have, because of the aging fix bug thing, if you have it on long lifespan or short it is broken, it is still not working. So I've gone ahead and turned it basically off. So I am keeping track here and I will show you. I'm gonna pause this. I will show you guys real quick how I'm keeping track of this whole thing. Okay, so here, this is where I am keeping track of it. So we here, we're here right here on this Wednesday. I just cross off the days that we've gone through just to help me <laughs> keep me you know, in check and where we're at. So Peter and Alice had a baby. This is James's brother and sister-in-law. They had a baby that was born. She was, now I don't know for exact when she was born, but she, Alice was pregnant. She was about a day or two before Eva. So I just put it here. So I am also keeping track of her because of this aging thing. The game gave her the name Jasmine. I've gone ahead and just picked Joan. Again, I Google these names, popular names in the 1300s. And it gives me a list and I just pick from there. Um, so I went with Joan, their baby for six days. So she will be aging up here. And then James here and Isabel are young adults. So they actually won't, they'll age up into an adult down here. Now I also have it, I'm keeping track of, this is the main family sim. So you see I have Agnes right here. That was James's mom. She was an adult, but she died in the year 1300, right when we started from a heart attack. And then we have James who is now a young adult and got married here. And then of course all their children will be beneath them, second generation. And so we have Eva here. She was born in 1303, or 1303, she was a baby, and she sadly died. I just put stillborn. And then I also have a page for the side family sims. And so I have like, I added a column that is what the relationship is to our main family. So I have Thomas here, which is Isabel's brother. He's currently a young adult. I don't have their year born yet, some of them. So I haven't figured that out. I have to sit and count backwards, you know, it's tough. It's rough for me, but we have Peter and we have Alice, James's brother and sister-in-law. And then right now I have it as Jasmine. It is going to be Joan and it's Peter and Alice's daughter born in 1303 and is now a baby. Just to keep everything straight in, in, in my head, this is the way I'm keeping track of it. This challenge is, it is rough. It is, I have to say, that is the most difficult part is the whole death rolls and stuff for this time period, which it's gonna be a long time like this. So we've just gotta, I've just, for myself, I've just gotta get used to it, I guess. We're just gonna have to have lots of and lots and lots of babies. So they're gonna get back from picking flowers and just take care of all of our chores. It is currently summer. I think it is the fourth day. So I think I'm going to actually plant the second week of the, like right here, or maybe on Saturday, we will plant our summer crops just so we can harvest it towards the end of the season. Plus that will give us some time to get a bunch of simoleons so we can buy a bunch of crops so that we have enough that we can store up. I'm going to try and get the mill. I think that the mill, the flour and the sugar and everything that you make from the mill will work with this cookbook. I'm gonna have to expand this kitchen here. Some of you guys have said at the end of the last video that there was some signs that she possibly is pregnant. So we'll have to see if those are true or not, but we're, we'll find out this episode if she is pregnant. So James is just gonna take care of these animals. He's also gonna have to dispose of this dead plant. And these are probably really out of season. Yeah, those are out of season. So I'm just gonna put them in here. And yes, I do have to have a computer in our inventory because we need it for the MC Command Center for this to 
mess with the settings and all of that. And I see we have a plate here. You know what? I'm just gonna sell it. We can use all the money we can get. I know there's a mod that I can get that changes the look of the computer. I'll probably get that down the road. Okay, she's, she is gonna need to make some dinner. It is evening, so I'm gonna have her just go ahead and make make some i don't know what we can make um we can have some fried fowl i guess we make just two i think we'll just start making a single serving of each until we have some children that can eat this with us because we can't have leftovers oh we do have this i do see we have cheese and meat oh you know what oh well i'm gonna let her cook it she enjoys the cooking anyway he's gonna do some painting here and she is feeling very flirty oh she's gonna sit down and eat her own fight she's like you can get your own food i made this for me he can get some of this meat and thing he can get this and she's come over here to sit down and chat with him for a little while and neither one of them are very tired here. James is more tired than she is, so I'm just gonna have her do the laundry. I know it is like 8.30 at night. Oh, she's got a baby rattle just popped over her head. She would rather talk to James here. And it is now, it is late. James has gone off to bed, so I'm gonna send her off to bed as well. Oh, also one of you guys had mentioned about this whole terrain paint thing um, that I can go into build and buy and bulldoze the terrain. I'm probably gonna have to redo this part, but it'll be worth it because I really don't like how this is. So I will just put this stuff back in here. Okay, there, I've got it now fixed and blended in. That's so much better. Very early in the morning and she has just eaten herself some meat and cheese and bread. And she's thinking about her brother. She's thinking about Thomas. Oh, and she's running, you guys. Guess what? Guess what? There, she's running too. Guess what? Somebody is not feeling well. Yo, they're both bored. He does need to be having himself a bath, but he's going to need to um, clean out the animal sheds and stuff. So I'm going to have him go ahead and do that and take care of this one. So we still don't have any uh, mood lit there that she is pregnant, but it means she's throwing up. So, you know, I'm going to have her come over here and take care of these chickens. She can go out and feed these chickens, collect the eggs. So she got one egg. I'm going to have her just sit and do some knitting and take it easy. She likes fitness. Okay. I'm just going to have her do a white a white wool rug is what I'm going to have her do. And she's going to the bathroom. She's knitting on the toilet. Okay, Isabel. Okay. That is not where I told you to knit at all. Oh, their archway is gone. For some reason, for some reason, their archway is gone totally disappeared oh this game be so dang glitchy oh my goodness and their chair one chair went in here okay just went in there okay um i had this one wow let's have him sell that then he's gonna have to take a bath oh i gotta put my floor back here now don't i forgot about this i need to, to put the terrain paint back over here which is just these rocks i think i had these ones here I, I, I'm pretty sure it was this one. And there we go. So I think he just used the last of the water. So uh, he needs to go get himself some water. So I think what I might do, I think I'm going to go ahead and put a pond, like a little pond over here just for collecting water purposes because I'm getting really tired. They have to go frequently to get water because we're off the grid or whatever. And I'm getting really tired of having to go way over here. I know it's not that far, but it is when you have to do like, you know, 10 trips a day. We actually have to dig a hole first, lower the train. Just a little, I think that's probably deep enough. I just like a little, real little pond. And we'll just put this here, raise the water, something like that. And I think I'm probably going to put a tree there and everything. Like, let's just go for it. Oh, wow. That is just not very good right there at all, is it? Maybe we need to put more water. I'm not very good at doing this, you guys. Is that any better? I think we have to smooth this out, maybe. Oh, and I also just see this right here. We have an eraser tool. Why have I never noticed that before? I don't know. Because I'm smart like that. Um, I could have just erased... What, that whole spot like here? Oh my gosh, what is wrong with me? Like, I could just erase this. Oh dear. It's like I never played this game. Oh my gosh, why? I'm so smart, aren't I? Look at that, we could just erase it. More smoothing on this one side. That's better. Now if I put like little rocks and stuff maybe around this whole thing. Yeah, he can now just come gather water, right? Yeah, okay, so that works fine.
Oh, and we just got notified Isabel is eating for two. She is definitely bigger than she was the first time around. So do we have a moodlet? Yes, we do. Eating for two, second trimester in 24 hours. Yay. So she's definitely pregnant. They're so happy. You know, they might have lost their first child, but there's a possibility that they will have this second child maybe this one will be a boy we'll have to see i'm gonna have him come over here and feed this llama he does need to take care of some of these things because um they they this llama is not very happy this one's fine how are our chickens and everything doing they're all good fine oh this one is unhappy i'm gonna have her come over here maybe oh it's are starving i thought she fed them but maybe she didn't and then we're gonna get back to painting because we're gonna need to expand this place i'm gonna have him go ahead and paint a classic painting now that i added this little pond which i actually really like that i think that's a cute little pond uh, i tried my hardest put some since it's summer i put some little wild flowers around it and rocks i think it's cute he's also got an angry what is this losing control that's it oh from a fear of unfulfilled dreams. That's it. James has had enough of that nagging feeling telling him to do this or that. Either he gets his way or nothing at all. Oh my goodness. He is just like really discussed fears after fulfilling once. And she's brought her food in here to eat. He's like, hi, you're looking very nice. You've got that. That beautiful pregnancy glow. So I see over here, he, fear of unfulfilled dreams. James feels unfulfilled and dissatisfied with how life is going. J James will occasionally become upset with his life direction. What is his, what is his life? What does he want? I'm gonna have her come in here and sit down, can resume knitting project. She's been working on this rug forever. Oh, you need to resume this. He can go ahead and sell that painting. Okay, she finally got that rug done. So this is the beautiful rug that she has done. Let me get into this mode. Let's put it like maybe something like this. Oh, look at that nice rug. I like having her do these projects. Um, now, would they have a lot of rugs? Maybe not at this time. I don't know. I really don't know, but we're allowed to have them, so we're going to have them. I like it. Adds a, fam a nice touch. She made it with her own two hands there. And I'm going to have her go ahead and do the rest of the laundry here. And he finished this, so we're going to go ahead and sell that. We've got 1,700 smullions. I'm still going to... I'm going to still keep ha having him do some classic paintings. I need to just get a little bit more, and then I'm going to expand this house a bit more. This fox is running around in circles. Look at this. This fox is just doesn't even know where it's going. This is locked, right? It is now. I'm just double checking here. That you're not getting in there, fox. You're not. It's a daily thing. You come here and you try and get in there. Is it Megan? Oh, it's Hope. I get them confused. There's so many foxes. Actually, it's usually the same foxes over and over again. And he finished a masterpiece. Yes. All right. So we're going to ahead and sell that. We've got enough now um, to expand this house a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and kind of expand this place a bit more. Definitely going to have to make the kitchen a little bit bigger because I'm going to get this mill, I think, and have her try that out wherever it might be. This right here. Okay, so I did expand quite a bit. Uh, we are down to 56 simoleons. He doesn't even really have enough to paint with. I think he'll have enough to paint like a small painting maybe yeah you can do a small one so basically what i did is we'll bring this down a little bit is i made the kitchen a lot bigger and i added in quite a bit of things more counter space and i took out the bookcase here sold it and i just put some shelving here now i've left it purposely empty because i'm gonna have james eventually get a woodworking table and make some sculptures that we can put up here this is how the kitchen is looking now and everything got a little bit more decor going on and then i just made the dining room a bit bigger and uh, moved the table that's all i did in there and then i got this bookcase instead we need to have a bookcase for her to do the mill so she is going to actually have to get a mill that the book the mill book the mill book <laughs> so i think it's 200 simoleons so we don't have enough yeah milling manual is 200 so we're gonna have to get that maybe james will have to he's gonna have to paint a couple things and then upstairs i had to make the bedroom a bit bigger so eventually as our family expands we'll probably divide this up okay he just finished this classic painting he can sell that. There, we got a little bit more money. He went and emptied the wash, 
the water, the dirty water. What? Is, I don't have it. I don't have the fame on. Why? Why is it doing this to me? It, I think it reset my whole um, thing. Yeah, it did. It turned on my get famous. I don't want, we can't have that on. No, 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 no. What else did it we have? Animal aging if disabled. I didn't have this disabled either. Wait, is it checked mean animal aging is on or off? Don't think I had that checked. I had that checked. Um, yeah. Why, why are you gonna be setting my things? Resetting my things. He is not notable, Newcomber. He can, however, paint some more. <laughs> She would like to get some sleep. She's like, can I please have some sleep? That's all I want. That's all I'm asking for is some sleep. We also have an hatchable egg. I'm going to have her go out and incubate it really quick. Yes, he finished another masterpiece. Go ahead and sell that. And yep. And then you can go to bed. So I wanted to get more light up here in their um, room. So I'm just, I'm literally going to copy this. No, I didn't want to copy that. I want to copy this and put it in their room. So I wanted them to have a little bit more light up here. Actually, I'm gonna go for the bigger, the bigger candle. There we go, it's a bit bigger. And then we'll also get rid of this littler candle. A little bit more light for them. And it is early Friday morning and we're gonna have him come down here. He is really hungry, but he is gonna have to get himself all around and uh, Oh, we gotta go get more water. Uh, we're gonna have him get some water. But before he takes a bath, he's gonna have to um, clean this, do his daily chores of cleaning out the shed and and the coop. And then I think I'm gonna have him go hunting and foraging. Oh, and she is experiencing some morning sickness, this one is. She is not feeling well today. And guess what? You, you get to feed this cow and clean the cow, and then you're gonna have to milk this cow because we need cheese. And James has come back, and he got a lucky escape. That bear got got a little too close for comfort, but James made it out without a scratch. He got a pigeon and two small rabbits. Wow, James, just well. That's not a very good hunting. Also, she is now into her second trimester. She's gonna be in her third trimester in 24 hours. And yo, she is... Her baby bump is is way bigger than the first time around, let me just say. I'm now wondering if it was because she was a teen before, and now that she's a... I mean, look at that. Look at that. She definitely... Oh, she's going to throw up, y'all. She is having... She's like, I milked the cow, and it made me throw up. She's just having a rough time. Um, She's going to need to make some food. Oh, she do need to have to... Oh, she suddenly has to go to the bathroom. I'm going to have her take a bath. She's like really needing it. She also needs to clean that. We're going to have James come over here and see if he can't feed this llama and take care of this llama before it gets very upset with us. And these chickens too, because she's just not feeling well. He's going to have to do all, all of her chores. She's just like, honey, I'm just not feeling very well at all today. This baby is making me so sick. Could you just go finish my chores for me while I have myself a nice bath? He's like, yeah, sure, honey. Let's do that. I will do that. So then she, when she gets done, she's going to have to make some food. Make some cheese, actually. That's why we, we milk the cow for a reason. So we're going to make some cheese. I think this cheese counts. You know what? I'm not sure. I feel like that that cheese um, in the cookbook does not work. Let's see if she can make. Yeah, I'm going to have her make some of this cheese here. I think tomorrow we're going to actually plant some stuff in our garden. He does have, he needs to fertilize um, three plants and oversized crops. So we're going to have to get that. While he's waiting for dinner to be made, he is going to, you know, actually he can clean this up. He got five eggs from there. Okay, so she has made that. I'm wondering now, can she make, yeah, she can make some of the cheese and meat and bread. There, she's got it. There we are. We're going to grab a serving of that and he can grab a serving of that as well. And there they are. They're just enjoying a nice lunch. Coincidentally, it is lunchtime, so they are enjoying a nice lunch of their favorite meal, meat, cheese, and bread. I mean, I like myself a good sandwich, so why not, right? And he's just like adoring her. He's like looking at her, just adoring her. Aw. Oh, he can now discuss his fears. So he's going to discuss his fears and tell her what he's afraid of. He's going to also tell her about this bear that he just nearly escaped. He's like... Honey, I was out hunting and there's a big bear. I just barely got out of there. 
before it got me. And he got fear conquered. Yay, breathing a sigh of relief. James has overcome his fear. It feels like nothing can bring him down. Oh, that's cool. He wants to stay outside for eight hours, yo. That's a bit long. That's a bit long. Oh, she's overheating. You know, we could turn this off, yo. I don't even know why we have a fire. We're going over here. Put out. We can put that fire out. She's like, I, I gotta put this fire out. I'm just so warm. We, we can't have this fire here. She's like, would you like to feel the baby is moving around a lot today? Do you like to feel and feel the baby kick? Aw, look at that. He's like, yes. Oh, how adorable. Oh, I think she's gonna vomit on him. <gasps> she's just having the worst time. We're gonna do some more painting here, I think, so he can get that woodworking table. I think the woodworking table is like 600 smolians, but I also want money for all these seeds we're gonna buy. And we're gonna have her, oh, her needs are going down. And then we have enough money. I'm gonna have her go ahead and get that manual, that mill manual, so we can um, use that mill. We're gonna have her go ahead and start reading that so we can make our own flour and stuff. And maybe down the road, she will like be making baked goods and sell it at the market. I think what I might end up doing is down the road at some point, I wanna make my own market and have them sell things there. Like I did in my Greek gods and goddesses challenge, I had a market. I kinda wanna do that here as well and have them sell things. And he finally got that done so he can go ahead and sell that. We're gonna get a woodworking table here, I think. So we can making some things for the house. Cause I really like the idea of him making his own furniture and you know selling it or maybe or um sculptures here's the woodworking table i don't think i have any custom content that replaces the woodwork this looks like old, old enough anyway so maybe i'll change the color of it it's 750 simoleons let's change it to this little more rustic color and we'll see if he likes this Maybe he won't even like like it. Let's have him do a dragon. Oh, and look at this. She wants to have a child. Aw, she wants a child so bad. Uh, she's level two milling. She can now pack harvestables into crates and also make animal feed. Okay, I'm gonna have her stop reading that for a minute and uh, go get something to eat because she's getting very, very hungry. And he has made a little dragon sculpture. So uh, let's put that over here that we just put up this. There's his little dragon sculpture right there. I'm going to have him go foraging, I think, real quick before. It's getting to be later in the evening, but he's just going to do a little foraging. You know, we haven't seen her brother come around for a while, for a few days. I wonder where he's at. She is just thinking about this baby that is coming and she's just knitting her some, knitting a beanie for us. She's, you know, she's afraid that maybe she might have another stillborn. She's just kind of wondering if the baby is gonna be okay. It's the fears that she probably has after losing her first child at birth, I would think. And James has come back. Let's see how well he did. So he got some cherries and he got some parsley and he got a bird egg I'm gonna have him do i'm gonna have him do a mirror and she's now level five of the knitting she can teach to knit is now available Ooh, that'd be good to teach like her daughters she can knit sweaters ultimate gift of sweaters she likes knitting yay knitting brings joy so she does like the knitting thing it is getting late it is time for them to get some rest i think and sleep oh i think she is in her third trimester yo maybe she it seems like she just got a heck of a lot bigger she's still in her second trimester but she uh, I, she might be having twins i'm not i'm not entirely sure because look at her she is like way bigger <laughs> um so we'll have to see. I'll be very interested to see if she's going to have twins or not. He did make this. So let's have him put that up here, maybe. Would they have a mirror? I would think they had mirrors back at this time. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, there's no nothing in the rules is that we can't have a mirror. We'll have him do a wall shelf. I'm trying to see if he's going to like it or not. So he finished it and he's going off to bed now. And she is still wrestling with that morning sickness. Oh, she is still experiencing that morning sickness. And she's thinking about, <laughs> she's thinking about her husband. What? Okay, we're gonna have her get something to eat here. She's not feeling well at all. It is 
very very early morning and i'm gonna have her do the laundry here finally on top of this laundry and she's just like oh the baby's gonna be coming soon and i just so tired and this it's just difficult doing everything you know washing his clothes is difficult but somebody's got to do it okay now she can hang these pristine and damp oh she's going to throw up she's like all that laundry all that scrubbing made me so sick oh that poor thing so for planting this it is summer so we can do blueberries and blackberries and then we can all year round, we can do watermelon, mushroom, and sage. I am also, because I'm using a mod, you know, with the a mill for our own, I'm also going to allow wheat so we can make our flour and sugar cane. So we've gotten our seeds and stuff. So he's just planting them now. And then he's got a lot of fertilizer. So I think that's one of the things he has to do is he has to fertilize. Yeah, he has to fertilize three oversized crops. Okay, so we did not, we got some sage, so we can definitely plant these things, but we did not get any blueberry or blackberry, so we're gonna have to, maybe I have them go out and look for those things. Oh, uh, we'll put down some of these. Oh, also I need to get some wheat. Maybe we have some in our refrigerator. Oh, we do, okay, so we have some in here. I'm gonna put these in his inventories. We got blueberries. We have any blackberries by chance i don't think we have any blackberries however nope we do not i'm gonna have him go take a quick bath oh he's gonna have to get some water maybe we'll go into town and and see if we can't find any get any blueberry or blackberries there buy grocery shop items let's see if uh, she can if they have any blueberries or blackberries um let's see fruit okay we have they have two uh blueberries oh uh, we don't have any blackberries yeah, they don't have any blackberries, but I'm going to check on the other market at home and see um, if they have it there so we can get those things. And then maybe, oh, this is flowers though, I think. She has blueberries as well. Buy that up. No blackberries though. I don't know. Does the game have blackberries? Meanwhile, we'll have him plant these and we'll also have him um purchase no purchase can we not use our fertilizer water oh he has to get his gardening skill up before he can even fertilize well you'll have it up by the time you get done planting all this stuff yep there he just reached level two okay so let's see here do we have any oh they don't have any these are just ingredients oh we don't have any dang okay well can i is it maybe the herbalist Maybe it is the herbalist, but they're now closed. There's a lot of blueberries. It's blueberry season. Okay, he now fertilized these. I'm gonna have her come in here and do some, oh, I gotta get some, dang it. I gotta get some uh, wheat. That's what we're missing. Oh, we only have 283 simoleons. I forgot I needed the wheat. I'm gonna have Isabel here. Can she plant these? Help him out maybe a little bit. So let's see, how does he get? He um, fertilized three plants or oversized crop. Oh, he hasn't done it yet. There he goes. And he is now level three and she's going off to bed. She's like, I'm done. Peace out. That's it for me. Oh, rooster. Oh, wait. Rooster chick is going to leave. Wait, no, no, no. Rooster chick. Rooster chick. Wait. Oh, rooster chick is. Oh, feed the rooster chick. And he's going to get the clothes off the line for his wife. She had it queued up. She has it actually queued up in here. But he's doing it for her. How nice. What a guy. What a guy. I think she's in her third trimester. Yeah, she's in her third trimester right now. And it is evening. Had a busy day. It's late into the evening. You had a busy day of setting up your garden here, which is looking good. I still want to get some more things, some more um, like regular mushrooms. Actually, I'm going to have him do another painting and before he goes off to bed. We'll have him do some more painting since it's only 8, 8.30. Oh, she's up again. Oh, she came. She got up. She's like, I'm hungry. I got to eat. Rooster chick is now a fully grown rooster. Okay, we got a rooster now, which is great. We are now a rooster here. That's the brown hen. That's a white rooster. Okay, it is getting late. I'm gonna send them off to bed here, get some sleep. It is 10 o'clock at night. As soon as he gets that painting done. There, he's got it done. We'll go ahead and sell it. And then he can go to bed. There we go. And I think with that, I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode here. So Isabel is in her th third trimester. So in the next episode, she'll be having this baby. Hopefully this time baby will survive. Her baby bump is quite large. So I'm thinking that she might be having twins i don't know i do not have anything on the lot for to have twins so it'd be totally 
up to the sim gods. In the next episode, we'll definitely be having this baby. Hopefully, the baby will survive. We've got our garden started. It is currently the middle of summer. Yeah, just past the middle of summer. So as soon as this stuff is grown and good, we'll probably harvest it since we can only harvest once. But yeah, I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. If you haven't yet subscribed, it would be amazing if you did. And also don't forget to click the little bell to get notified whenever I have a video go up. And I hope you all have a great rest of your day and I will see you in the next video. Bye.